Good morning my loves, welcome back. Ignore my hair, I'm letting it kind of fall out a little bit. Welcome back to Vlogtober. I am gonna head downstairs, just got ready for the day. I'm not sure what our plans are today, but this is what I'm wearing so far. And then I've also got my big teal checked coat, but I'll put that on in a minute. And I also obviously haven't got my shoes on. I think this is an old one from And Other Stories and then my Free People Cargos. So yes, I'm gonna head downstairs see what Zach and the baby are up to and not sure what we've got planned for today but hopefully we'll go out and do something. a little weekend vlog. I'm in my Sunday comfies today and I've just put on the Bare Minerals original foundation just for a bit of like evening out on coverage today but how nice does it look on? I always forget how lovely this foundation is when I haven't worn it for a little while um, and I've also popped a little bit of blusher on that's literally all I've got on. Oh and a tiny bit of concealer as well but it's such a nice foundation it really is but anyway and it's also like so good for your skin like there's so little in it um so if you are having like a bad skin moment it does take a little bit to work to work into the skin but um it is so nice but anyway i'm gonna head downstairs because i've had a little bit of extra sleep this morning so i want to go see my baby Hi, i've been terrible on the vlog today yeah Bluey is on in the background, so I won't talk for too long. We've just been chilling, basically. Not much happening. You've been upstairs for last time. Well, yeah, and then, then in the last hour I went up and did some Vlogtober bits. Just getting on the Discord. Yeah. Whilst this baby was out having a nap. Did you have a nice nap? We never put her hair up and I literally just shed a tear about this ponytail because it was so cute, in case you didn't grasp that, because it was so cute and I like, actually cared about it. Um, but yeah, we don't often put our hair up, but it's definitely pretty long now. And it does look a little bit scraggly at the back because it's kind of all different lengths. But she looks so cute. Oh. <laughs> Hi my loves, so I didn't finish the vlog yesterday, so you have to forgive me. Just popping in from the future, to say thank you so much for watching this vlog. I know it wasn't massively exciting. I just was not feeling myself yesterday. I think it's a combination of about a thousand different things, <laughs> just small incremental things, which when added up are just making me feel a bit like, Bleh. I am going to regain my energy, hopefully. I've got lots of exciting things planned for the remainder of Vlogtober, so yes. Anything to update you on that happened over the weekend? I don't think so. Zach went out last night as well, so I also had the baby baby bedtime and everything to myself, uh, which is another reason I was not vlogging so much. I did actually receive Stoner over the weekend, um, which is this month's book club pick. 
Stoner by John Williams. So yeah, it arrived for me and I wasn't planning on starting it, but there's a little bit of excitement happening in our book club channel on the Discord and people saying that they're already really enjoying it or they've read it and they've really, really liked it. So I got too excited and I did start it and I am loving the opening pages. Just the kind of thing that I needed and wanted in my life right now. It's very beautifully written, kind of quiet tale. And yes, I love it. And it's made me think I want to read more quiet books going into the autumn winter season because I just love them and they're like when there's when you get a good one they're probably like my favorite books ever I was meant to reread the Greenlanders gosh maybe I even put it on my reread list in 2020 and never got around to it but I really really do want to reread the Greenlanders um, I'd quite like to reread In the Distance at some point, such good wintry books. I'd really like to reread A Thousand Acres as well, so two Jane Smiley's. Might set up some buddy reads for those as well. Also, thank you to um, those of you who have joined us on Patreon, because I know I've been talking about it a lot on here, but I do chat a lot on the Discord and stuff, and so... I can't help but mention it um, and obviously we've got book club and all sorts and buddy reads and all sorts going on on there. Yes, thank you to those of you who've joined us and welcome to our little club, our little online community. As I've said before, it's one of my favourite things that I'm doing online. It's just great. And do you know what else? I also read a bit more of The Trees yesterday by Percival Everett and the two kind of weirdly work quite nicely together because they're like total opposites like that's a very satirical take on a murder mystery novel so they kind of work nicely together because they're like total opposite books um so depending on what mood i am i'm gonna dip into both i think anyway my loves that's all my reading updates from the weekend thank you so much for watching and i will see you again very soon bye